Star Wars The Clone War Season 1, Episode Number 22, ladies and gentlemen. This one is titled Hostage Crisis. Yes, this is back to Season 1, guys. This is the episode we did not catch in season one because we are going chronologically and now we are finally back to it man i just checked out season three episode number eight and uh we kind of had cad bane working with java the hut putting a, a plan into effect it seems like to break zero out of prison now i'm not 100 percent sure if this is going to connect to that arc or if this is going to be a different story completely but i'm assuming it's going to connect to that arc regardless even if it doesn't i am super excited to check this episode out guys you know i've been loving 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 Clone Wars episodes and we are making our way through this series like I don't know about you guys but it seems like it's going pretty quick for me man like for how long this series is we're already on season three and we've made our way through a handful of episodes and we're coming up like I don't know I feel like we're getting we're, we're, we're finishing this pretty quick man I know we're we're not halfway through yet but we're close to halfway through kind of and um I'm gonna be sad when it's over, man, but we still got a lot left in Clone Wars, and we still have Season 1, Episode 22, more specifically, to check out today, so I'm gonna stop wasting time, guys. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna hop into this episode. Before we do, I do, as I said, if you guys are new to the channel, you do hit that subscribe button, comment down below what you guys wanna see next, man. Drop a like on the video for your boy. Full reaction will be up on Patreon, as well as early access to the next two episodes, if you guys wanna check that out. Link in the description down below. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna hop into this episode. A secret shared is a trust form. That's facts, man. If you want trust, you gotta give some trust, baby. Here we go. My guy is breaking him out, bro. It's happening. See, if I watch this in release order, I'd be like, what the fuck is happening, man? Oh my god, Cad Bane is a badass and he's teaming up with people. Cop him. Ah, oh, this bitch. All these bounty hunters teaming up. Damn, he broke his neck, bro. God, man. Cad Bane is so good, bro. He really put together this whole last plan. Fuck. I'm supposed to be on a meditative retreat. We should go away together. I know a place far away from here where no one would recognize us. I have to bring this bill before the Senate. It's important. Isn't our love more important to you? But I... No, no, but. To me, there's nothing more important than the way I feel about you. Well, I mean, you prove that, Anakin. <laughs> when I finished constructing my lightsaber, Obi-Wan said to me, Anakin, this weapon is your life. No, Anakin, I can't. A Jedi lightsaber is... Imagine she accidentally clicks the button. <gasps> That'd be some shit, bro. If all you want to do is make fun of me, I think you should just go. That's not what I want. Boy, my guy Anakin trying to get his feet wet, bro. And by feet, I don't mean feet. You know what I'm saying? Like, goddamn, bro. He's like, of course, there's always some shit going down when people are just trying to have some fun together, you know? What is it? Senator Philo has called a meeting in the lobby before we vote on the enhanced privacy invasion bill. We must hurry if we are to stop the vote. Coming, Senator Amadala? Uh, of course. Damn, she has his lightsaber still, huh? Fuck. Here we go. Boy, Cad Bane moves so smooth, bro. Look at him. That was clean as fuck. Morning, Senators. I don't know who you think you are. Have no intention of listening to this kind of insolence. Shut your ass up, three eyes. Look at you. What did he think was gonna happen, bro? Like, that's Cad Bane. He don't play. Sorry to bother you, Chancellor, but I've taken control of the East Wing of your Senate building. If you have attempted such a foolhardy action as to kidnap a senator, I assure you that it will be met with appropriate force. I'm in control. I make the rules now. This probably, Palpatine definitely wasn't expecting this. Come on, Palps. This is the one time I wish you would do something badass and help us, bro. I Bro. can't let them search me. Well, hello there, little lady. And who might you be? Think you're awful young and pretty to be a senator? Bro, why would you make eye contact with him, Padme? What is you doing? Come on. Padme, you looked right at him. This is General Skywalker. Chancellor Palpatine, can you hear me? My dear boy, I'm glad to know you're there and all right. You have to get to the power control room and turn on the security seal. 
Well, it's time to fuck him up, Anakin. Come on, fist to cuff, baby. You have two more floors to check. Come on. We've got two more floors to check. Bro, you, I thought you had to be, like, in front of somebody to do that. You had to be... Like, he's far away. He's not even looking at him. What the fuck? That's OP. I didn't know you could do it from that far away. Holy shit. Damn, bro. That guy Anakin really out here. He got the fist to cuff action. I mean, it is a droid, though. That bitch is strong, I'm sure. Interesting. The droid's gone. But there's good news. The Jedi's unarmed. Go. Bring him back to me. Oh, fuck, man. That's such a smart move by him. Oh, there's a little bitch. Once Zero has been released and is handed over to me, then your associate will be released. Cad Bane's been in this business for a minute, man. What have we here? <laughs> what do we have here? Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Blasted. Son of a bitch, man. God damn it, bro. You had to really try and show how much you love her by giving up your lightsaber, bro. Couldn't you just give her a ring or something? Clones. The doors. Look at this bitch, bro. Oh, it's so bright out here. <laughs> now get me as far away from Coruscant as possible. Now. Got what I want. Turn your senate and your senators. But don't try anything until the sun has set. Zero is so... Oh my god, such a character. I bid you all a most respectful farewell. Let's go. Cad Bane really is that dude, bro. <laughs> bro, was that really necessary, bro? You were foolish to think you could get away with this, bounty hunter. I'm afraid it is you who have been foolish with your senator's lives. Holster him. Stand down. Cad Bane's a badass, dude. I'm sorry. I know I keep saying it, but he is. He really is that dude. <laughs> oh, you can't imagine the unspeakable things I've suffered. The horror. How about some dead senators as payback? Yeah, he was gonna do it anyway, bro. Oh! Barely made it out that bitch. Time to pay up, Hut. I don't work for free. <laughs> Zero's facial expressions and sounds are like so like I don't even know, bro. Holy fuck, guys. Alright! That was the season finale of season one, man. I just like Bro, the more I see episodes like this, the more I'm just like, what were they thinking? Like, literally, bro. Season 3, episode 8 is what I watched prior to this, and it connects to this. It's the start of this mission. And this is the season 1 finale, bro. So, like, imagine just watching season 1. I think the end of season 1 was the whole... I, I remember what it was. I don't... Fuck. It was that big ass battle with Obi and Mace Windu leading the charges when Boiler and Waxer met that little girl and everything like that. And then it would have just led straight into this for the season finale, bro. Like, what? Like, bro, what? Like, why? I, I don't understand the release order, man. Why did they not just release it in the chronological order? Like, I don't understand that, man. Oh, regardless though, I'm like, I, I'm so glad you guys did convince me to watch chronologically because if not, I'd be so confused at so much stuff and I would kind of just, like, what the fuck is happening? You know what I mean, regardless, dope episode. It's always cool seeing Cad Bane. Like I said, man, he's a, he's a dope bounty hunter. You know, he's like, he's, I don't know how to explain it. Like some bounty hunters like Aura Singh, I hate her. I don't like her. I don't like her at all. But then like. Cad Bane, like, I got respect for him. Like, it's almost like I'm rooting for him to win at times, you know? Even though, like, I know he's not a good guy technically, but it's like I'm almost rooting for him to win sometimes. Like, this episode, I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of rooting for him just a little bit, you know? Like, deep down, I knew I kind of was, but I don't know what it is about his character that I like so much. And I know he's a very popular character because the first episode I watched with him in it, all you guys seem super excited to see him as well. So. I know I'm not the only one that feels that way, man, but 
regardless super dope episode i don't know where this is going to lead to next um i don't know how this how zero getting out is going to affect the story or if it's going to even affect the story at all or maybe you know maybe this um republic is now going to go after cad bane kind of try and hunt him down because this dude literally not only broke out zero but he attempted assassination on all those senators he blew up part of the wing uh in the senate building bro so like he did a lot of damage man and he damn near took out a handful of senators plus a jedi bro so like if they just let him go and don't like kind of pursue him or at least try and pursue him i know he's probably pretty elusive but it's gonna be kind of weird you know if he doesn't and this is this was like the first time i feel like there was something like thrown like a wrench thrown in the plan of palpatine since you know like i'm sure other stuff has happened but something huge like this i mean he literally had no idea about this most stuff he has an idea about like he was the one who straight up hired cad bane to steal the holocron and stuff you know but like this he had no idea about this was something job of the hut did or well, the huts did this so he had no idea about this. this this was like a complete surprise to him so that was interesting to see because like i'm trying to think of another moment you know in this series where something like that has kind of happened but i can't think of one man i really can't like he's kind of been the mastermind behind everything that controls everything and even when something does come at him or come you know as an offensive to the republic in a sense he's kind of planned it or he knows about it you know but this was like completely new and completely different i feel like for him he, it was just something he didn't expect you know it was something he had he that probably threw him off a little bit you know it kind of caught him off guard but maybe this was the i'm trying to think of when that cad bane episode was so so technically chronologically i've already watched that episode so technically palpatine the chancellor knows who cad bane is in a sense right because he already had hired him at one point to holocron obviously cad bane doesn't know that chancellor is palpatine the guy who hired him but palpatine does know who cad bane is so i don't know man super crazy stuff super crazy connections and kind of just mind fucks you about it but Super dope episode. Like I said, guys, let me know what you thought about it in the comment section down below. Like always, also, if you guys did enjoy this reaction video, make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button. Full reaction will be up on Patreon as well as so early access to the next two episodes if you guys want to check that out. Link in the description down below. I hope you all have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one. What is going on, everybody? I hope you did just enjoy that video that you watched. If you did, make sure to leave a like and drop a suggestion down below for what I should check out next. I want to give a couple quick shout outs to the homie Dude Tim, the homie That's So Gordo. The homie Philip Boyce and the homie Brandon Royce for supporting me at my highest tier over on Patreon, guys. Link is on screen right now as well as in the description down below. I offer a couple extra benefits over there such as early access, full length reactions, giveaways, and a couple of other things. If you guys want to check that out, it would be much appreciated. But I hope you all have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next one.